one player summed up the Springbok attitude, it was probably Oz Durant, their famous loose head prop. Oz made his first appearance in 1994 and continued to be a key player in the side until 2000 when he suffered serious injury that kept him on the sidelines for almost two years. But in 2004, Oz returned to the side and became the last member of the 1995 World Cup winning team still playing professionally. Out it goes and oh, what a tackle on Howard. It was the Bovon one. That is a wonderful tackle from Oz Durant on Pat Howard. Olo Brown, who played for New Zealand, was fantastic. He was a, possibly the first sort of modern prop going forward that could actually, he was a great scrummager, but he could run, he could pass, he could tackle, he, was, he had brains, he knew the game. Um, and he, he was one of the, the, those guys that moved that game up, sort of thing like that. Yeah. To win the World Cup, you are the world champion, and no one else can argue with that for four years. So, you, know, you can be ranked number one in the world, as certain teams have been over the years, and played great. But you have to, you now have to win that World Cup. I mean, that's knockout rugby. Just, just win it. The first player to ever score a World Cup try. Michael James is the type of player, ever since I first saw him play, who can change a game and switch in a test match. He's the Buck Shelford has though as he wrestles his way upfield. Here's Michael Jones! Look at this! There's the support! Kerwin! Sensational try! Uh, I don't know what his potential is. I think it's one, one that you'd have to say uh, it may be unlimited. He um, broke through, uh, broke through one tackle, ran around the winger, and as Dusty here, the fullback was coming towards him. He chipped the ball over with his left foot, and Michael's right footer uh, caught the ball and dived over the try line. And Alan Wetton and I were running about 15 metres infield from that, and I turned around to AJ and I said, "Who is this guy?" Tremendous role model for, for, for young people in New Zealand, um, on and off the field. One man again, Pierre Spies. It's not surprising in a country that's so 
bats are wonderful in terms of its physicality and power. Pierre Spies seems to lead the way in this front. He's just a tremendous physical specimen. He calls for Dupree and he just wants the ball. Now I love this canvas of a field, this picture, as he runs away from the Crusaders three-quarter line. Tremendous pace. 